65 year old male who was operated was put on hyoscine hyoscine is an anticholinergic for his post operative nausea and vomiting the next evening attendant started complaining of excessive sleep in the morning and decreased sleep in the night this is known as a uh, reversal of sleep wake cycle gesticulating to self means acting on the hallucination talking to the self means probably he is hallucinating visual or auditory we do not know and he is acting on that restlessness with evening worsening of symptom evening worsening of symptom means sundowner phenomenon i hope some of you might have guessed the diagnosis by now if not then see this line patient was oriented to place but not time so disorientation evening worsening and uh, alteration in sleep wake cycle so what are we dealing with the case of delirium acute confusional state characterized by disorientation then uh, reversal of the sleep wake cycle and evening worsening and what is the drug of choice haloperidol so how do we approach this question the disorientation suggests the diagnosis of delirium hyoscine is known to cause it and treatment is by antipsychotics actually delirium the treatment is treat the cause but when the cause is not known we give antipsychotics to manage the agitation next question a known alcoholic was brought to the emergency room with complaint of palpitation and suspiciousness have a look palpitation suspiciousness tremors pulse rate this but the patient was oriented to time place and person here we do not know whether the patient has had alcohol intox or alcohol withdrawal but the sign tremor suggests that we are dealing with a case of alcohol withdrawal but since the patient is oriented it is not a complicated withdrawal it is an uncomplicated withdrawal when the withdrawal become complicated it manifest as seizures or delirium in that case the patient will be disoriented or will have seizure here the only first sign of alcohol withdrawal is tremors then palpitation means autonomic hyperactivity which is seen in alcohol withdrawal and suspiciousness means alcoholic paranoia which is also seen in alcohol withdrawal anyways the management is going to be benzodiazepine because alcohol withdrawal condition the drug of choice is always and always a benzodiazepine now which benzodiazepine to prefer chlor diazepoxide librium is the brand name a very famous drug then you can give lorazepam liver friendly benzodiazepine or oxazepam some people give diazepam also but these three are more used next question a 20 year old male presented with head and neck twisted to one side head and neck twisted to one side Uh, flufenazine was given flufenazine is a typical antipsychotic after a typical antipsychotic if head and neck are twisted to one side what's the diagnosis eps and which eps it is dystonia dystonia and what is the drug of choice for dystonia injection promethazine dystonia is an important topic if you do not have notes of it please note it from this slide clinical history is suggestive of drug induced acute dystonia and it is the first eps to develop occurs within hours of administration of antipsychotic first eps to develop clinical feature muscle spasm in any part of the body eye rolling upward oculogyric crisis head and neck twisting to one side torticollis laryngeal spasm dystonia can cause death by laryngeal spasm so it's a lethal eps prevalence 10% but more common in young males yes high potency drug like haloperidol and drug of choice is anticholinergic injection promethazine can be given diphenhydramine can also be given it's an important topic all of you i expect you to note the points of dystonia next question a 30 year old male was diagnosed with major depressive disorder and was prescribed on tablet acetalopram 10 mg once daily dose major depressive disorder acetalopram so acetalopram is an ssri what is the most common long term side effect of ssri delayed ejaculation nausea is the most common side effect but delayed ejaculation is the most common long term side effect ssri very very important topic adverse effect of ssri most common if they ask upper gi side effect through 5st3 receptor nausea is more common than diarrhea qtc prolongation headache paradoxical anxiety again through 5st2c action 
fluoxetine causing maximum insomnia and somnolence restless leg syndrome and most common long term side effect is sexual dysfunction delayed orgasm that's why ssr is a drug of choice for premature ejaculation because it delays the ejaculation okay depoxetine causes more than paroxetine and then sertraline acetylopram later a middle aged female patient was diagnosed to have ocd the defense mechanism not seen please see not seen undoing is seen reaction formation seen projection is a psychotic defense mechanism ocd is a neurotic disease and isolation is seen so six defense mechanism it's a very very famous question for pg exam even in all india exam they ask what is the most important defense mechanism in ocd then answer is undoing for pgi 1 2 3 4 5 6 isolation of a reaction formation undoing repression regression and displacement okay next question a 35 year old male who is known case of psychosis on regular treatment developed disturbed vision on examination retinal pigments retinal pigments psychosis retinal pigments so which anti psychotic causes retinal degeneration retinal degeneration thyroidism corneal pigmentation chlorpromazine chlorpromazine is cornea corneal thyroidism is retina please note the ocular side effect of antipsychotics chlorpromazine deposit in the anterior portion of the eye cornea and the lens and thyroidism only antipsychotic to cause retinal deposit once again r d r d retinal degeneration retinitis pigmentosa that's why the maximum dose is 800 please remember these are very very famous mcqs on antipsychotics interpret the following finding on sleep study eeg related questions are asked and uh, this time i have not given image i have given the findings eeg shows low voltage mixed frequency mixed frequency sawtooth waves eog electroculogram activity plus and emg atonia i think you might have guessed it is a rem sleep in rem eeg is mixed eog is positive and emg is negative in nrem EEG is mostly slow EOG is negative and EMG is positive while in awake stage EEG will be fast and both will be positive this is how we interpret a sleep study i have taken this from kaplan textbook so if you don't have this chart please uh, wait take a pic of it or copy it snapshot whatever you want this is from kaplan psychiatry textbook wakefulness mixed frequency eye movement eye blink high tonic activity nrem vertex waves then sleep spindle k complexes then delta 20 to 50 delta more than 50 and gradually emg decline okay but present but it is complete atonia emg absent and rapid eye movement and mixed frequency with sort of three you are supposed to note this chart all right last question a young female presented with repeated actions of bad bathing on phobing further the series she was getting repeated thoughts of contamination and had to bath otherwise would lead to anxiety which disorder we are dealing with a case of ocd and ocd has fixation at anal stage of psychosexual development you might be knowing this history is suggestive of ocd and ocd as fixation at anal bed as per freud psychosexual stages let's revise these stages in the next 2 minutes very simple we need to remember the phase the age the organ of gratification and the disease linked to fixation oral stage birth to 1 and 1/2 years the child derives sexual gratification through mouth so breast sucking and breast biting gives him erotic pleasure the disease link at this stage is schizophrenia alcoholism and dependent personality One and a half to three year anal stage, anal and parent anal. The feces holding and feces letting go gives him erotic pleasure. Disease link OCD and OCD. In phallic stage, the organ of gratification shifts outside the body, male towards mother, female towards father. 
male develops adipal complex female develop erectile complex males have castration anxiety female have penis syndrome disease like sexual dysfunctions paraphilia hysteria latency phase no organ of gratification neurotic disorder super ego is formed at this stage then genital stage neurotic disorder